Hello everybody and welcome to your next Android development tutorial series. In this tutorial we're going to be um, downloading the IDE we're going to be using for tutorials. And the IDE that we're going to be using is Eclipse. The reason I'm using this is it's the one that I'm most comfortable with and the one that most Java users use. I know a lot of you might use NetBeans and stuff. You can still use this using NetBeans. Just the compiler of my choice is Eclipse. So we're going to be looking on how to uh, download Eclipse. So let's go to google.com or ca whatever. And in this search bar right here we're going to type in Eclipse. And um, we're going to click the first link eclipse.org. And then we're going to go to downloads. Okay so you see just like the um, the Java development kit we've seen a lot of different things that we could download right um well basically we just want to download the one at the top eclipse for eclipse ide for java developers now right here you only see stuff for windows right correct so if you want to choose them for your operating system then you can choose linux here you download the linux 32 bit or 64 bit or the mac you can choose the 32 bit or 64 bit so for Windows, I would choose um say 64 bit. I would click that and then I would click to download. Or you can click one of the mirrors right down there. Um save it to where you want. So say click desktop. So I would save the zip file. I save it to my desktop. Oh, it takes some time to download. Oh, it's taking forever. But basically, in your zip file, you should have an Eclipse folder, Eclipse folder, like this. And once you open up the Eclipse folder, you're gonna see a lot of things within the folder. And what you're gonna see right here is the Eclipse.exe, and it's gonna have this symbol right over here. And once you double click that, you're gonna open it up. Now, if the last tutorial, if you never downloaded the Java development kit successfully, then Eclipse won't open. So, if Eclipse opens, then that means you have successfully um, downloaded Eclipse properly. So, that is it for this tutorial. We've gotten the IDE. And the next tutorial, we're going to be learning. We're going to be either, we're going to be learning about how to download the Android SDK. And then we're going to be learning about how to set it up with Eclipse and such. So thanks for watching this tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. And bye.